So when, do you ask, did we start getting stoned? Was it the Stone Age or much later? Was there a single moment when early humans inhaled some skunky sativa smoke and realized they felt pretty dope about it? The evidence here is pretty spotty, but we know that wild cannabis plants have only trace amounts of the psychoactive compounds that get us giddy, including THC and CBD. So researchers have looked for evidence of plants with higher concentrations, which we would have had to cultivate specifically. As I said, we have a long, long history with this plant. But only 4,000 years ago do we start to see the evidence of humans nurturing specific strains for different purposes, whether fiber or drugs. You can actually see in the way different strains diverge what uses they were bred for. Those bred for fiber have more gene mutations that inhibit the stems from branching out, so they have taller stems and more fiber in the main stem. But the plants that were bred for drug use have mutations supporting more branching, which also means more flowers. Those plants are shorter, but they also tend to have more THC. 